Hey, how's, it, how's everybody doing? Oh, we're wobbling all over the place. Yeah, let's try that again. Ooh, look at us go. Yeah, earthquake. Ah. Yeah, so everybody having a good time? Everybody doing good? It's Saturday night, and uh, I get to look like a meth head again for the next, uh, the next um, month, because I broke my second fake tooth off again. So until... Uh, until next month when they they put a crown on it, this is what I get to look like. And I get to sound like Sylvester the Cat for uh, another month. Stop moving, camera. Uh, this thing's so worn out, and I know I bitch about it all the time, but yet I do nothing about it. So don't sympathize with me. Just make fun of me together. Anyway, time to uh, pull a few more things off the shelf. Holy shit, stop playing with the camera, me. It just keeps wobbling and keeps moving, and I should have had it steady to begin with, but I don't care. Because it's me. And if you watch my videos, you know, whatever. Anyway, whatever. Look at that. Look at this thing. Look at this. Like fucking half a Nosferatu. But it is what it is, and it'll get fixed soon enough. Fixed soon enough. Anyway, so off the shelf, a couple of uh, toys and figures. You know how it goes. Anyway, I'm going to start off. I'm going to go through the few predators I have. <clears throat> this one's uh, Father McConaughey. No, I'm kidding. Wrong predator. Anyway, I'm going to go from predators. I'm going to go from least favorite to favorite. So least favorite is this one here. This guy here, which still looks pretty badass. It looks pretty cool. Uh, the only reason I bought this was I was at, uh, it was Horrorama a few years ago, and I wanted a predator without the mask. So, um... All the ones I already had, had had the helmet and the mask and everything. I wanted one. They had this one, which was, I, I can't remember how much it was, like $32. And then another one, it was like $45. Looked a lot better, but I wasn't going to pay that much. Just, you know. But I think it's fine. It's kind of got like a He-Man body, like a tiny little waist. But it still looks pretty cool. It's got like some decent art articulation. And, you know, it, it looks good. It, it doesn't look bad. It just uh, didn't look good as the more expensive one, but... Got the gun up on the shoulder. Like I do like it, but I just really wanted one without the uh, without the helmet. But yeah, I do like this guy. So you can open up, you know. It's got the thing. Like it, it's it's a well made toy, and I think the things come out. Yeah. It's a well made toy, but that's that's my least favorite of the bunch. Uh, I only got four. I don't have like 50 of them. But. And then this one here, which is a little bit more cheaply made. I, I don't, I think I just like the, the color on this a little bit better. Like this one's very dark. Where this one's uh, bright and looks good. You can see a lot of things. It doesn't have as much of the, uh, like the articulation and everything's still good. You know, it's got things that open up and, you know, do predator things. And it looks good. It's just, I don't know, there's something about it. It just looks more like a toy rather than just a collectible. There, there are, uh, both of them, actually all of them have accessories. They're just locked away. Sorry, I found fucking like this and my camera's still fucking moving around. Stop it. I got two more videos to do tonight. Stop fucking around. I don't have time for this. <sighs> okay, that was stupid. But anyway, um, I'm just really mad that I broke my tooth again. But uh, it still looks good. It's got like the, I guess, I don't know, they call them dreadlocks. I, I don't know what they actually realistically would be, but fuck, man. You're going to get annoyed with me moving this camera, but I'm getting annoyed with the camera moving on its own. Let's see if I can just hold it there. Just stay. Just stay. Please. Let me try this. Move this up like this. There's my ceiling. And then drop it down like this. Maybe that'll work. Maybe that'll work. We're four minutes in and most of it's me playing with the fucking camera. And I think that might be good. Anyway, so that's the second one. And this one here I, I bought randomly at a comic comic book store I walked into. It doesn't really do a whole lot. I, I just like, like the way it looks. You know, the helmet looks pretty good. Things don't really move around a whole lot. The things don't open, but it looks good. It's like, still well detailed. It was out of the package, it was used, and I think he was trying to sell for 20 bucks or something. I, I said I'd give him 15 and 
and he was like okay with it. So actually, no, sorry, he was selling it for fifteen. I asked, I said I'd give him twelve for it because that's all I had on me. But uh, yeah, it, it still looks good. And my favorite wine, which is the first one I ever bought, and, and the weird thing is, it, it's it's blue. Like I don't know what it is about this one. It's just my favorite. It's it doesn't even have like a lot of the. Uh, articulation and movements that the uh, like the the figure itself but it doesn't have like a lot of the detailed movements in, in the in its parts but it's still pretty cool like I don't know what it is about this one that I like better I think it just the face looks the best you know if you compare it and... mm, kiss but <laughs> but yeah I think uh, it's just that like the face looks the best it, I mean the, the detail in, in the artwork in it is probably the best. Oh, this is bent. Do these go in and out? No, I don't think they do. No, actually they do, but I'm not gonna force it in because I know me, I'll break, I'll break it off if I try and push those in, so. But yeah, this is my favorite of the bunch. Got a lot of detail. I don't, I don't know what company this is. I'm fairly certain it's not NECA, but I, I, I could be very, I could be wrong. It could very well be, I'm not sure. It's uh, the sand the feet. Oh, it is NECA. Okay, now that's probably why it's so detailed. This is uh, well, that's a that's a NECA. Anyway, and I got a few more things here. Um, I will go with. I may have put this in a video before, but this is uh, Michael Myers. Obviously, this is the uh, the NECA figure from Halloween Two. As like a replaceable head, like you, you can have the head. <laughs> the only thing that's really different about it is, is it's the head with the uh, the mask, with the blood streaming down the eyes after he gets shot in the eyes. Spoiler alert if you've never seen it, but whatever. Anyway, but it's NECA, so it's got a lot of detail. It looks really good, like j just the creases and folds and the clothing, the boots. It's a good character, and it comes with uh, the, the pumpkin from the opening uh, credits that uh, opens up and reveals the, the skull inside. I may have put this in a video before; I can't remember, but uh, so, but it's pretty uh, pretty cool toy. And yesterday, this is Saturday the fourteenth. Yesterday was Friday the thirteenth, and um, <clears throat> so every Friday the thirteenth, I watch one of the Halloween or sorry, one of the Friday the thirteenth movies. Uh, and uh, last night I watched uh, part four, and this is actually the figure from part four. And it's got the uh, the gravestone that you see briefly in the movie. It's, it's just kind of out of place in the film. It's just sort of there, I guess, to remind you what you're watching. I, uh, I never really understood the point of that, but uh, anyway, this is the figure. It's like all NECA figures. It's really well detailed. It's... You know, right down to the creases in the pants and, you know, small details, the veins in the hands. Like, it's, uh, it's really well done. And then, of course, there's the face underneath. So. Mask back on. It looks good. And the last thing I'm going to show you is, uh, this is from Mego, but this is, uh, Teen Wolf, Michael J. Fox. There. And this is a doll. This will stay in, stay in the package. Stay in the package. Fuck, this is driving me up the wall. And I get to deal with this for a month. But uh, anyway, it looks really good. Like, it's it's well done. It's, you know, I uh, when I bought this, I got it cheaper because the, the box is damaged. So I was like, okay, I mean, I'm not buying it to resell it. So, I mean, uh, maybe after I die and... The best garage sale in town is, is in my yard selling all this crap, but that's about it. But, um, yeah, I think it looks pretty good. Just the uh, box art is just a shot of probably a production shot or production still of uh, Michael J. Fox. As the Wolf, Mar Marty Abrams. Is that, uh, no, Marty Abrams is the guy that uh, came out with Mego, which is uh, one of the earlier, uh, the earliest uh, companies that made action figures and stuff but uh yeah it's uh pretty cool
And I guess that's it. That's it for today. Just a few uh, things and an excuse to make a video. Anyway, I will uh, thank you for watching this for those who did. And I guess I will see you in the next one. Bye.